The Boys Season 4, Episode 3, will keep the red flag flying, shifts the series into high gear as the boys' personal problems make a bad situation worse. The Boys Season 4's three premiere episodes are dense stories where a lot happens. Sage and Homelander's larger plans start to become clear. They want nothing less than to stage a coup of the United States government. Meanwhile, the various members of the boys switch tactics from killing soups to flipping them. This change in strategy could make the difference. Huey Campbell is fighting a war on two fronts, both as a member of the team and one more personal. His father had a stroke, now lies in a coma, and Huey's estranged mother appeared for the first time since he was eight years old. While he's been trying to sue her for control over medical decisions for his father, at the end of the episode, he learns her troubling truth. Through season 3, Frenchie and Kamiko were the boys' best relationship, and their non-platonic affection seemed obvious. However, they've since decided to be just friends. While the Vought superheroes stage their saves, Kamiko and Frenchie are attacking evil simply to eliminate it and presumably save lives. Although, Kamiko's the one doing all the fighting, since a drug-addled Frenchie can only watch the unfolding violence as the drugs replace the blood and gore he saw with visions of bubbles and rubber ducks. The Deep shares a bloomin' onion with Sage, who seems uncharacteristically dumbed down. They even hook up, which was the last thing viewers expected of someone as cold and calculating as Sage. Mother's Milk, much to Huey's dismay, tries to flip A-Train into helping him take down Vought and Homelander. It seemingly works, as he tips them off to a meeting between Sage, Homelander, and Vice President-elect Victoria Newman. After botching his first save by accidentally killing his friend and stunt coordinator Koi, Ryan is disillusioned with superhero life. Butcher reaches out to Ryan for a proper catch-up. Homelander is confused that Ryan is upset about the death of a human, something he's trying to directly teach him not to believe. While Butcher saw Ryan's pain and responded with compassion, Homelander could never do that, and his fragile psyche fractures even more. While meeting at the Vought on ice rehearsal, Sage and Homelander lay out their larger strategy. Once the election is certified, on January 6th no less, they will kill Singer, thus making Newman president by default. Once she takes power, Homelander and Sage want Newman to put a Vought hero in every city with authority over the police, denounce whoever they see as an enemy, revise history, and more. As fascist takeovers go, it's a terrifyingly solid plan, especially with superpowers in play. Newman remains unconvinced, and the meeting is cut short when Huey is discovered hiding in a vent. The Boys was always in tune with contemporary politics and biting social commentary, but season 4 is more blatant about it, and may be rubbing some people the wrong way. The Boys struggle to barely escape situations alive, are the boys getting worse at their job?